Hello everyone, it is Francesco here for Keep Productive and in today's video we're diving into how you can use AkiFlow to plan your day. Now I'm going to show you a little bit around this application. We have got a full course if you want to check it out in the link in the description. It is free and you can naturally jump deep in this application, learn all of the elements and also you can check the link out to AkiFlow in the description below. So here we are with the AkiFlow Mac version. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna plan a day. So I'm gonna to plan today, and as you can imagine, uh, use some of the elements that AkiFlow offers in terms of its features. So let's dive in. Today I've actually got, um, starting round right about now, I'm actually doing some recording. So what I can do inside of AkiFlow is I can write down recording, and as you can see, it's now a task. So what I'm actually gonna do is extend this because I'm actually gonna take about 19 minutes and um, it's got a high priority as well. So I'm gonna put high priority. And as you can see, a task has been sort of updated on this side. Now I'm gonna add this to my work folder and I'm just gonna pop it inside of admin. And as you can see, it's given itself a label as well. So in order to do a little bit of time blocking, I'm gonna drag this onto the scene. And I'm sort of looking at it, I'm probably gonna take a little bit longer till probably lunchtime to do this. So you can start to see your task being sort of pinned to the calendar. Anything that's pinned to the calendar will appear down here. Now at lunchtime, I do need to pop to Boots and the Post Office. Now, as you can see, these are two different types of tasks because they're actually connected to my Todoist account. So I can click in and I can see that these are actually from my Todoist account. And I've now timestamped them, which means that I can see them uh, in, a, in a sort of linear fashion, which is perfect uh, for moving forward. Now, I do need to also send a card to my nonna. It's not going to take as long as that. You can see this weird, like, uh, colouring around the edges. And that's because I've added it as my highlight for the day. I can remove that by um, removing the goal because I might want to make the recording my highlight of the day. So something I need to focus on as I go throughout my day. Now, of course, I love my nonna, but, um, I, you know, it's uh, for work in this case is a priority, but I, I will send her a card, don't worry. Um, and what I can do as well, I can drag it down here. Uh, so a new item. So I'm starting to build my day out. As you can see on this left-hand side, you can see that I've got my regular time zone, so time zone I'm uh, in, and also uh, the time zone of... Uh, the actual, uh, another country, I think I put LA, no, Abu Dhabi, uh, but I can press Z and change the time zone. So if I want it San Francisco, uh, I think I changed it to San Fran there. Yep, there we go. So it's now got San Fran times. So I know that five o'clock is seven o'clock, uh, five o'clock is <laughs> nine o'clock uh, in the morning. So I can use option space to bring up this lovely command bar. And this is really a, a very much of a skill when it comes to using AkiFlow because you can, if you've got something to do, you can do it faster. Okay, so I'm gonna start adding a task using the brilliant task blocker. So I need to do some editing. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna say today at 2.30 p.m. That's uh, perfect. And then I'm going to press equals. It's going to take me 30 minutes. So that's how to add any duration. I'm going to add a slash command and say, uh, this actually is like a bit of editing YouTube content. And I'm also going to add a label. But in this case, I'm actually going to create a new label called editing. There we go. So as you can see, I've got the task ready. I'm going to go ahead and press option enter. And as you can see, I can add a bit more detail if I want to. In this case, I don't actually need to. And as you can see, the tasks of um, editing and reviewing finance, because they come into the same time, I've created this grouping. So I can actually remove grouping if I want to. Uh, there we go. So, But if I want to, I could group or not group. It's really up to you on how you do it. But you can see here that I've got the editing automatically added. And I did that without touching my uh, mouse, which is pretty cool. So I'm able to sort of plan a day. I'm actually gonna extend this and drag this one over here because it's completely uh, gonna take up my time editing. So I'm gonna put that there. So you can start to see a better idea of how you can bring stuff together. And I can actually go to inbox and see some of the other items that have come into my Todoist account and also that I've saved inside of here. 
So it's really helpful to be able to sort of switch between the two. And if you want some of that customization on this side, you can. You can see just a day view. You can see four day view, so you can see what's coming up in the future, uh, which is all very helpful. So that, that, that simple command bar is actually something that saves you a bit more time uh, when you're being able to connect things up. And you might see that I have a selected task here. Let's just go ahead and um, snooze it. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and snooze it for tomorrow at 8 a.m. So that means that will appear inside of my um, in my actual today area tomorrow. So I should be able to see it here um, in the morning. So that's a little bit about how to plan your day inside of AkiFlow. Um, there's one last feature I want to show you to share availability. If you want to be able to share some dates that you're free, you can pump them into your calendar. And as you can see, you can copy them clipboard and share them uh, to somebody in an email, which is perfect. That's just a, a, a small feature that sort of helps when you're looking to plan meetings. But anyway, folks, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to check out the free course, you can check it out in the link description. AkiFlow will also be there as well if you want to check it out. Thank you very much, folks, and I'll talk to you all very soon. Cheerio.